being judged. Most of us have terrible responses to being judged, don't we? Don't you feel just absolutely shocking inside of yourself when you're judged? Right. Okay, so what's happening inside of the soul? So here's my soul. I receive an emotion from my external world that I am lesser. Because that's what a judgment is, right? A judgment is saying to you that you're not as good as that person, me, these other people, all the people on the planet, whatever. Does that make sense? That's how we feel it. Enter it, isn't it? Far away. But the, um, when you get that, that um, being judged thing, that, that is given to you as a truth. Of course. Supposedly. Yeah, yeah, of course. Because anybody who judges you thinks that they're right. <laughs> Everyone who judges you thinks they're right. Right? So, yes, of course. Every time you receive a judgment, it will always come at you as if the, from the person who thinks they are, they are in truth. All right? So, so yes, they think they're true. Now, the key thing to do is to go into the emotion that you feel as a result of that judgment. So let's say the, the judgment is you're a narcissistic person. Now, that's the judgment coming at you. Right? In other words, you're self-involved, self-important, you have no care or love for anyone else, you're just like totally interested in your own welfare. That's what's being said to you. Now, if there isn't some kind of an emotion in me that gets triggered by that judgment, I'll just go, okay, won't I? and walk on by. It will have no effect on me whatsoever. If it has an effect on me, then it tells me that I have an emotion inside of me to release. Right? So in other words, if my soul resonates in any way with the judgment that's coming to me, then that means that there is an emotion inside of me that I need to address. Now, it might not be the emotion the person thinks is the truth. It might be a completely different emotion. So, in other words, if somebody says to you, you're totally selfish, and you have an emotional response to that, right? It might not be that you're selfish. It might be a completely other emotion that causes you to respond to that statement. And you need to allow yourself to feel the response. Because the problem most of the time is we don't want to feel that emotion, that causal emotion that my law of attraction has brought me. And instead, what do I do with that? I don't want to feel it, so I don't feel it. feel, and what do I do instead? I then create a denial of the emotion. I then go on the defense or the attack of the person who's projecting that emotion. Straight away I'm out of harmony with love. Does that make sense? AJ, even in the denial there's a feeling there though. There's always a feeling. Yeah. So always. It's, it, but it's, it's like, it, even in the denial, there's the feeling under the... Yeah, the feeling's always there. Oh, the feeling's always there. So my choice to deny the causal emotion is always caused by another emotion. Yes. Yeah. So the emotion might be, I'm ashamed of myself. Because so, in the past, I, did, I was yeah. selfish. There could be a pretense that I'm not feeling the emotion, but the emotion is there. Always. Yes. The emotion's always there and I need to allow myself to access it and be honest about it. When I try to go on the attack to what's coming in at me, now I'm no longer in this state. Right? So, and again, remember this is happening emotionally and not intellectually or by words. So, so the truth is, 
I can, I can sit there and write nothing, say nothing, and right at that moment I am just doing this as bad a thing as the person who just attacked me. <laughs> because I have this projection coming from me. And, ah, you know, like, I don't want to. <laughs> That's coming from me. And, and while I'm in this state, I am doing the same as what they're doing, which is projecting a judgment at them now for their judgment of me. So what's that doing? That's really like getting out a hammer because someone knocked you on the knee with their hammer. And then when they get out their machine gun, you get out your bazooka. And then when they get out their, you know, missile, you get out your nuclear warhead, right? And all of it is just because we denied our emotion. And a lot with that denial of the emotion is that there's not an expression of it. It's, there's a living of it within, and then that just seeds and seeds, and that can go on for... Forever, actually. Yes, It, it possibly right. yeah. can. Uh, it doesn't normally, of course, because by the time we hit the spirit world, we see them all and start addressing them.